Hello, welcome back. Gonna go ahead and equip this damage health one. Slowly make my way over. No! There we go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh dear. Um. Uh, fireball, where, where's, where's my flare? Yes! Absorbed and deflected it back at her. Wow. Hooray! What did you do to do that? Oh, I was wearing like some type of item. I forgot what it was called. Well, resist shock already from Boots of the Eel. Oh. And then reflect spell 8% on self oh. with the Eagle Feather Shield. Hooray for that! Another vampire matriarch. What's in the coffin? Oh, wait, take that lockpick too. There you go. There you go. Secret room. Only 12 gold? No. Not much for a secret room if all there is is 12 gold in there. here than there was locked up in a hidden area. I mean, what the heck? I don't know. Oh. Let's see, anything else I need to explore? No, I fully explored the whole thing. Yeah. No need for the fur boots. Oops, going the wrong way. Well, at least I got a lot of vampire dust. Yeah, I guess that's good. Yeah. Still need to level up somewhere. I have to do it outside the cave. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Kick the sword. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, more when I should have played an Argonian. Why? 
immune to like or like resistant against disease and can also breathe underwater. Yeah, that would have been a good idea. Yeah, oh well. I'll still play the character. Ooh, uh, Primrose. Alright. Still making my way to Chaden Hall. more alchemy ingredients. Drink the restore fatigue potion and eat the rat meat. If you want to buy a horse, go inside and talk to Tobas. Briand Garana can talk her way out of anything. Of course, all she usually talks about is herself. Hmm, oh god. You too. Continue on, we are in Shaden Hall. The main reason we were going here so that way then we could get some more quests for a fighter skill. Oh, really? Onimonies and speech and custom, Bruma and Shaden Hall show Nord and Dark Elf incidents. Oh. Okay. Wait, let's go back to the plants. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, I love doing that, especially when I've heard people bitch about how stupid it is. It's like, who fucking cares? It's fun. Yeah. It's like, seriously, are you that devoid of life that you want to bitch about something as dumb as that? Goods and stores. Yep. Try and sell off some of the wares I have. Keld of the Isles, guardian of the Fighters Guild. And how did I achieve that high rank, you ask? Patience, caution, slow and steady wins the race, my father always said. Careless fighters get one last white shirt and a box. Not me. <laughs> I've settled down here. Nice place. A little slow, but it suits me. Burrs grow kosh as a bear sometimes, but I got thick skin. Doesn't bother me. They say that when you murder someone, the Dark Brotherhood comes to you in your sleep. It's how they recruit new members. Good day. Hmm. Horvath Rauzgash. We've got everything the adventurer needs. I'm an old adventurer myself, and I know what's wanted. That Bruyan Garana is really full of herself. She'll talk your ear off if you let her. Hmm. I'm retired from adventuring, but you might try the old mine they call Rickety Mine out east along the Blue Road. Another possibility in that direction might be Kemen. It's an old alien ruin. You might also look at Quithwater Cave to the north. I cleared it out, but I haven't been there in years. It might have new tenants. 
Nice. <laughs> Definitely gonna be looking at that stuff. What can I interest you in? All right. Ooh, fine iron battle axe. I can actually sell off all my clothing items here, though. That's good. That's good. Need health items that I can create alchemy with. I let that go too cheap. There you go. Don't think I need anything else on that side. Uh, I could actually give up my iron arrows now. That's a good deal. Oop. Mason numbing. I'll hold on to that. As well as also the short sword of frost. I guess then I could just toss my steel mace since I now have one with like magical properties as well as also my steel short sword. Mm. A good price for a good customer. Awesome, I could give up the rings. The main thing are these clothing. Let's see, you like me enough for that? Yep. Alright, someone else can use those clothing items. That's a good deal. Got tons of fatigue potions, so. Let's just dump them all. Respite potions, eight of them. Don't eat dragon's That's tongue. More than I would usually. There you go. Bone meal, have no need. Imp gall's pretty good. Uh, shepherd's pie. If I could find another thing to cure disease with it, I could actually make a cure disease potion. But I can also sell all this vampire dust. There you go. Uh, don't need that scroll. Welkin stones. I'll sell five of them. An excellent bargain. The flawed ones. I have no need for a knife. <laughs> I took that from a mud crab, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna... Give off the wolf pelts. Mercantile skill increases. Bada boom! Alright, I think that's everything. Come back and see me again. Alright. Goodbye. Oh, I love her. She's she's like one of the best traders. <laughs> yeah, because you can give her like basically everything. Some traders you can only give certain items. But when you have traders like that where it's just like, here, just dig all my shit. I don't want to go wandering aimlessly. That's awesome. Yeah. Cool little designs right there. That'd be cool if I could make a 3D model of that. I should try. Shoes. Where's the Fighter's Guild now? That's what I gotta be looking for. There it is. Ah. Just look for the tapestry. the short sword over to the right, make some numbing up top, four acts of frost. I got a lot of frost items. You do. <laughs> That's all I basically have. <laughs> all right. What? Can you repair some items? If it's broken, I can fix it. All my magical items, I just need them healed or repaired myself uh, from someone else at this Good time. Good day. That's not bad. Yeah, but when you use repair items or you're able to repair, it's when you can start repairing magical items yourself. Oh. Yeah. Where is he? Where's that guy? Looking for the Fighters Guild guy. Where'd he go? What? We're all talking about the Emperor's murder. We have no Emperor. 
What the heck? What time is it? Okay, it's like 2.30. I came all this way to go see the Fighters Guild guy so he could give me some more quests so I could go hurt things some more. And he was gone. And he's not even here. Out of the fighter's guilt for some odd reason. <laughs> right. Ah, these fly amanitas. There we go. Bleh. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be doing that so much now. Well met. Ah, there we go. Otumbar, Fighters Guild Guardian. Maybe you saw me in the arena a couple years ago. I was a contender. I got out while I still had the original set of legs, arms, and eyes. Fighters Guild is a perfect place for me now. Any good rumors? Anvil is all in an uproar. First the chapel attack, now the prophet ranting about the end of the world. Hmm. Good day. There's the porter again. There he is. I have no idea where he went. But he has a sweet glass mace. You here looking for work, meat? Maybe you want a contract? Yeah. I suppose I've got something for you. We need a weapon shipment delivered to Desolate Mine. That's your job. Alright, any rumors? They charged me five gold for littering. Littering! I barely make that in a year. These fines are ridiculous. Ever since Ulrich Leyland took over the captain of the guard post, this city's gone downhill. It's getting almost scary to walk the streets. The guards have imposed new ridiculously heavy fines for every infraction under the sun. They almost seem to make up laws just for charging fines. If you can't pay the fine, they can take your property away or toss you in the castle dungeons. Nothing we can do about it, really. If you're interested, go talk to Lavana Nadarin. She seems the most outspoken against Ulrich and his new finds. All right. Move your ass, <laughs> I love that. But still, you shouldn't even be littering. Right. Okay. Yeah, you deserve a fine for that. But I mean, you know, if it's something like that is a mistake, <laughs> And so be it. But if you're going to go ahead and be an ass and just do it out of no good reason but to do it, yeah, you should be fine. Right. Let's see now. What can I do? I restore that. Restore some intelligence and agility. Huh. Okay. And... Fortified personality. Restore strength. Fortify health. And sleepy time. Just for an hour. Just for a little while. Just doing it for the leveling. You've ascended to level 5. Everything you do is just a bit easier, more instinctive, more satisfying. It's as though you had suddenly developed keen senses and instincts. All the three items. There you go. Yeah. There you go. And we're 
remove that tag now. And let's see, Desolate Mine. There you go. That'll be for my new quest, but I will have to stop it right here. We will make our way to Desolate Mine in the next one. So thanks for anyone watching. Have a good one, okay? See ya.